Kentucky court goes all in on a denial when the surveillance shows the disabled policyholder working. Now the general principle is that surveillance should have some relationship to the policyholder's credibility and to the standard of disability. Many times in my practice I find that the surveillance shows that the policyholder is engaged in normal everyday activity. And so long as the policyholder has been truthful with their doctor and the insurance company, in my view and in many courts' view, the surveillance is of little value. But if the surveillance film shows the policyholder lying about their activities, all bets are off. Let me tell you the story of Mr. Quarles in Quarles versus Hartford Life. Well, Hartford had the right to request a proof of loss throughout the claim, as all disability carriers do. Quarles had lied about working while collecting his long-term disability benefits. And the carrier had surveillance on him. And they found him working, which he had denied in an in-person interview with Hartford's field investigator. He even dodged questions about his employment during an in-person interview. Quarles argued that the surveillance was a malicious attempt to discredit him. But the court saw right through that argument. The denial of his claim was a slam dunk and the Kentucky court upheld that denial as they should have. So what's the lesson here is? The lesson is that a policyholder should be truthful in their activity of daily living forms. They should be truthful with their treating physicians. If the long-term disability carrier wants to take your statement, you're probably being set up for a claims denial. You need an attorney to prepare you and represent you in your claim, but you need to be truthful to that attorney and you need to be truthful to your doctors and you need to be truthful to the attorney, to the uh, insurance company. Otherwise, you're just setting yourself up for a claims denial and more importantly, perhaps a legal cause of action against you for committing fraud. I don't represent liars or people who engage in fraud, but if you have a legitimate claim and your claim has been terminated or it's been denied, call me today at 727-894-3188 for a complimentary consultation. I'll help you get the benefits you truly and rightfully deserve.